Hey guys, it's Redstone here. <clears throat> I want to start off this video by saying thank you guys for all the support going through this channel. Uh, I just hit 270 subscribers yesterday. I mean, that's crazy. Um, when I was a kid, uh, when I first started this YouTube channel, which was about three years ago, um, I never expected to be here. I'm be completely honest here. I expected to close down my channel right when I started it. This was just a hobby for me. And it still is. I mean, you guys know that. Um, sometimes I post one video per week. Sometimes I post two. Um, sometimes I post none. It depends. Um, but I kind of want to address why I haven't been posting any videos lately. And also, I want to address some of the questions that you guys have been asking me. But the first thing I want to address is that thank you guys so much for the support for this channel. I would not do this if I wasn't getting good support. Uh, like a year back, I was I was predicting to, um, you know, not do YouTube anymore. And then all these famous YouTubers just went down to my comment section, you know, 3D Printing Nerd, Chuck, Hellebuck, Angus, at Maker's Muse, those three YouTubers came down and said, just keep grinding. And I look back at the video, and I am embarrassed that I made that video. And I'm embarrassed to this day, okay? But what you have to realize is that I'm extremely busy. And I'm not just saying that. Uh, I know that a couple people I know say that they're really busy, even though they're really not. Um, I'm not calling anyone out, but I'm just saying that some people I talk to, uh, no one that goes to my school, there's other people I talk to that just say they're busy because they want to avoid me. And, you know, I, I just kind of don't really want that experience. I mean, it's a bit strange. Now, um pretty odd um that i'm doing this video actually because i usually don't do these videos on my channel but i mean you know it's a bit strange but at the same time i just have to deal with it um you know my videos have gotten overwhelming support and i'm gonna keep doing this don't worry guys i was actually supposed to have a review today it kind of fell through the cracks because i've been extremely busy and not, like, just busy work. Um, I'm actually doing, you know, homework. I'm dealing with friends. I'm dealing with a party. Um, I'm planning on my party on Saturday. Uh, sorry about that. Um, but, yeah, so I'm a bit upset right now that I could not do the review of the Carvey. Um, and I've just gotten a word that I am moving out February 20th um, to go to a different house. For about two weeks. Uh, that is because they're doing a whole remodel of my room and my house. And it's going to be kind of hectic. Um, so I just have to lay back and relax and see what happens. I also want to address something else that has been really bothering me lately. And this is, a, this is actually about school. It's also about just pure life. Um, you know, kids go around me and they just call me dumb or stupid. And I look at those kids and I'm saying, you are so wrong. And tomorrow, Thursday, I have a science test. And this science test means so much for my future. And I don't think you guys really know that. And if I bomb this science test, I will not hear the last of it from my friends. Or Mr. Ron, who's my teacher, by the way. Um, and I'm kind of disappointed in myself. I'm going to be completely honest here. I'm pretty disappointed in myself that I'm not as smart as William, Zach, Athena, the three people in my class, if you were wondering who those were. And I just want to be as smart as them. As them. And I'm just kind of tired of all the kids at my school going to those three people and asking questions about their homework 
to them and just completely avoiding me. I have a question. If you're from my school and you're watching this video, who is the only kid in 8th grade who has built three computers in the last week? Who's the kid in 8th grade who's actually built a 3D printer? Who's the kid in 8th grade who just takes things apart and builds them up again? Who's the kid in 8th grade that builds furniture because he thinks it's fun? Who's the kid in 8th grade that can figure out problems for himself and work on things by himself? And I know, I know what you guys are thinking. You're a spoiled brat. Look at me like that. You can. Look at me like that. But I'm going to tell you this right now. I am not a spoiled brat. I work my butt off every single day. And my friends, my, my teachers, don't appreciate that. Whenever I get home, I'm always extremely sad. Um, sorry. Um, I'm always pretty sad when, when I come home. Uh, because I know that I have other people... Um, who actually care about me on this YouTube program. And I just don't want to be called dumb anymore. That's all I want. And I guess my friends don't understand that. Um, you might be saying, you might be just writing your con comment down and say, dump those guys. But you don't understand. Those are the only three people I can talk to. And it's sad. I know, but I just have to deal with it. I seriously just have to deal with it. And if I can't, then maybe the world's not fit out for me. But I'm an eighth grader. I'm going to go to high school next year. And that's going to be a fresh start for me. A fresh start for this YouTube channel, a fresh start for me. And, um, yeah. Okay, let's get some, let's get more positive. Now you guys know what I've been going through at school. But let's go through some positive things. I started a new channel. It's called Mr. Aviation Guy. If you guys did not know, I love planes. Uh, I'm addicted to them, pretty much. Um, I want to become a pilot when I grow up. Uh, I bought, like, this, uh, bought this, uh, flight gear. Um, it's the Logitech, uh, you know, yoke and throttle. It costs about $200. It's a really great yoke and throttle, to be honest with you. And when I when I went um when I go on planes, I feel exhilarated. I I feel I don't know if I should use this word in my YouTube audience because I know a lot of the young people. I feel like a high. I feel high, to be honest with you. Whenever I'm on a plane, because I feel so great, and it's not like a bad high. I'm I'm just saying that I feel good. Um, and, and, like, what's kind of cool about planes is that there's multiple airlines. So, what I did was I opened up a channel, and I compare airlines, and I put nice edits. I actually edited the videos. It took me about three edits to edit one, um, and it's, it's American versus Delta. That's the only one I have out. And uh, I have some nice landing videos. I have some nice take-up videos. And two of those, I think, five videos are actually taken by me. Uh, it's the Boeing 767 on American. Uh, they're back-to-back, -back, if you're wondering. Those were taken by me. The other ones, I asked for permission. Uh, one of them was actually taking off during, uh, like, Irma. Uh, actually, Hurricane Irma, sorry. Um, which is pretty cool, actually. Water was everywhere, but... Yeah. Um... So, I just want to make you aware, I have a new channel. Uh, now, you might be saying, oh, Ryan, you, you left us in the ditch. No, this is still my primary channel. And I'm still going to do 3D printing content. Don't get me wrong. But I'm going to start veering away from that a little bit. Not, like, a lot. I'm still going to do, like, 3D printing reviews and stuff like that. I actually haven't been able to 3D print the last two to three weeks. 
Uh, and the main reason is because I'm adjusting my setup right now. I actually have a 3D printer right on this table right here. And, um, I'm just adjusting my t setup. And to be honest with you, I don't even have time to set up these printers right now. I mean, dude, school has been busy. And to get into the private school I want to get into, it would seriously take me studying every single night for the IC. Bit crazy. So, this video has been going on for probably over 10 minutes. I have actually no idea how long it's been going on for. But guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, you probably didn't. But I hope you guys leave constructive criticism in the comments. Or just constructive, just constructive, um, you know, just, just leave constructive comments. Because I don't want to go in there and delete comments and report comments. You think that's what I want to do? No. No one wants to do that. Not one YouTuber creator that I know of wants to do that. So, guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. Um, that's you. The Carvey Review will come out next Wednesday. I have it pinned on my calendar. I am definitely going to do it next uh, Wednesday. And, uh, yeah. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, watch out for next Wednesday. Because if I don't post the um, Carvey Review... You guys will get something. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and bye!